This is Super Saiyan 7 Sendish. I am presenting to you a uh, March or no September 2013 ban list version of uh, Destiny Destiny End Heroes. Um, I will admit I'm definitely feeling the loss of Stratos with this build because e call just it can't go grab my destiny heroes where stratos could so that that hurts a little bit uh even rhoda doesn't get the big ones it only grabs my uh my one my diamond dudes doesn't grab doesn't grab plasma or dogma but here is the deck. I have. Oops, my monsters didn't get organized as well. They're supposed to be when I found the extras. Okay. So we've got. Three plasma. Three dogma. And. Three diamond dudes, and that consists of my destiny heroes for elemental heroes. I've got three Aeolus and three Prisma, and then since those are lights, and of course, part of my strategy is making uh, making shining. The two elemental heroes, my fusions I really focus on are Shining and uh, Escredeo. I've got the I've got the honest. I also, for some more light power, I've got three Cyber Dragons. Um, this is a Fusion Gate build, so I can make Cyber Twin out of this mess. Uh, I have one Evolution Burst in my spells for just turn my Prisma into Cyber Dragon and kill a card. Or I'm also running two uh, Chimera Tech Fortress Dragons. So if I'm running against machines, Cyber Dragon and take them up for Chimera Tech. And that's it for monsters. Spells. As I said, it's Fusion Gate build, so three Fusion Gates. Running one Terraforming. Uh, I could maybe run a second terraforming for a little more speed. It's 40 cards as it is. I already don't really have room for traps. It's all spells and monsters. Uh, so just one terraforming. Makes it a little bit hard to get to my field spells, but it still works mostly. The two e-calls. And one reinforcement. Forget for adding my monsters to my hand for my deck. For draw power, I've got one card trader. There is a second one in my side deck. I've got one allure of darkness, two destiny draw, one trade in. It's my draw power. Besides my adding from Rhoda and Ecall. Of course, for more fusion ability, I do have one miracle and two parallel worlds. Uh, my side deck has my other two miracle fusions. I'm running two MST and one evolution burst for card destruction type of th type things. Uh, given trade in destiny uh, or D. Destiny draw, uh, whatever else. If I want to get back one of my, or just to get back one of my level fours, or my eights to my hand for my graveyard, two warrior returning lives, so I can replay monsters. And I do banish, so I figured I throw in one burial. Burial definitely could be one of my replace cards. 
the only three cards I have in my extra deck or my my side deck are of course the two miracle fusions and the the card trooper or card trader. My extra deck. Uh, I don't actually have multiple Destiny and Dragoons anymore. I traded one of them away. So I need to get back a second Destiny and Dragoon. Uh, as I said, my focus for the E-Heroes are Shinings and Escardeos. And I've already mentioned Cyber Twin and two Chimera Tech Fortress Dragons for my cyber cyber aspect of the deck and then I have four uh, like seeds one star 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 leash Paladino, Paladinamo one Excalibur and one Blade Darmer Ninja those are my only seeds for this deck it is exactly 40 cards it's I've tried to make it streamlined as best I could. If you have comments or questions, feel free to post them. Let me know what you think of the deck. I could definitely looking for some suggestions to make it a little bit faster. It seems to be a bit hit and miss. Um, let me know your thoughts.